Just look at that view behind us. Fantastic. So the plans have changed completely now. Tomorrow we'll be supposed to ride back to uh, Tirtha Ali. But the boys are going to stay here one more day. Yes. Huh? Just just back yes. Back. Mm. How is it? I haven't tasted it. I'm just saying. Mm. I'm doing a kripal like. Mm. Mm. <laughs> salute, 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 salute. Cheers. 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 Bulanjian. More coming. Oh, yeah. 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 Dosa will be like killer. Fish curry, bangde, bangde. What is this? Prawn, prawn curry, bangde. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, how do awesome. I take it, man? Ganga Avati River. And I think we are very close to Gokarna at this point. This is such a beautiful, amazing view. So we are at this property called Red Earth in Gokarna. It's on a cliff and that cliff overlooks the ocean. This kind of place feel good, no? Yeah. When you ride. Especially the last stretch was also nice, no? Small lanes, village. Huh? So I think the place where we parked was quite stunning. So the motorcycles have a great view. They don't see us, eh? Huh? They don't see us. Where do we have a good view? You can sit outside, no problem. It's a good view. Just checked into the rooms at uh, the Red Earth Gokarna. Just had a shower and I'm feeling all fresh. Nice, comfortable room. You've got the windows and uh, beyond the trees, you have the beach. It's a fairly decent sized room. And uh, basic amenities. The wash basin, you've got AC there. A compact bathroom with shower. So this is the sort of place we probably spend less time in the room and uh, more time out there at the beach. Boy is already there so I'm on my way there as well. Well the motorcycles are parked right up there and uh, that's the beach. This is one of those places which doesn't have cellular network so you gotta Basically cut off from the rest of the world. So what's this? This is your library? This is the front office and library. Ah, okay. Office. Where's the spa? Down there. So the spa overlooks the ocean, huh? Fantastic. What a place. Huh? Beautiful property. Huh? Huh? You can ask for a better place. You can't. I mean, <laughs> we'll stay here tomorrow. So we can speak to somebody. Uh -huh. Spend the whole day tomorrow. Chill, enjoy the property. Uh -huh. Big set through Karwar we can travel. Uh -huh. We'll leave in the morning. 10 hours we'll reach Bangalore. We'll have all the energy if we stay back today. That's a long ride. What say? We can go to the beach today, take a stroll on the beach, mm. chill in the evening, have good breakfast, lunch, dinner, be at the beach. This is what happens. You come here and you... That's where you want to live, man. Get mesmerized by the place and the boys <laughs> now don't want to leave. <laughs> Joe doesn't want to leave, Vic doesn't want to leave. You have some coffee? I'll make a coffee for you, buddy. Seriously, an awesome place, no? Amazing. Life so long and it's worth it. They say a hotel is all about location and I think location wise Red Earth couldn't have gotten it better. Amazing. So all the rooms are behind there at the back. You've got the front office there, the restaurant there and you've got the spa down there somewhere. Look at the beach, it's amazing. Yeah. Oh yeah, location. Everybody wants to stay back one more day. We'll have one, uh, there is a nice uh, is fantastic. I'm okay either way. Give me a hug buddy. The only thing is on uh, the Sunday will be a crazy ride though. It's okay man. Sunday will be a crazy ride. I would recommend it now, of course. Not that you get to the very good amount. Oh, wow. Wow. So, if the toddy is fresh, I'll get it. Is it 10 hours? Oh, yeah. yeah so, yeah, they are saying, can we ride in a planet? We have to check out. Well, we to See, if we are out. totally relaxed tomorrow, huh. you know 6 o'clock will uh, be fit. Yeah. Yeah. We had stopped on the way from... Uh, what is it? Yalapur. From here, we go to Yalapur, Yalapur. Maybe leave around 6.30 or so at least. Yeah, okay, 6.30. So let's do one meal out there. We can go to Shweta. 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 We'll hire a cab. Yeah, we'll hire a cab. Yeah, we'll hire a cab. Where? Innova we hire. I know, Innova we hire, go to Shweta. All of us can go in one car. We eat, sleep and come back. Yeah. Wherever. So the plans have changed completely now. Tomorrow we'll be supposed to ride back to uh, Tirtha Ali. 
but the boys are going to stay here one more day. Yes. Sridhar, Sridhar, uh, staying back. Yes, yes. That, uh, one yes. more day and Gokarna and uh, lunch tomorrow at Karwar. Yeah. Yes. Shweta lunch. Lunch at Karwar and uh, we come back here and we do a fire up a barbecue. Yeah. yeah. Aditya will fire up a barbecue. Our host here at Red Earth. I'm, I'm just me. I'm no great host. <laughs> but here's to the host. You know, I just told him we are planning to stay tomorrow. And uh, so yes. Uh, I think when you ride out after so many years, three four days, uh, boys have some josh in them, and they want to spend one more day in this beautiful setting. So that's what we're gonna do. For now, I'm gonna just savor, enjoy my coffee. The coffee is very good, huh? I still look at that. Huh? I look at that. I'm from Myanmar. Oh, you're from Myanmar. Good coffee. Good coffee. You want? No, not right now. <laughs> There's no burp, nothing, right? Correct. That's what I'm saying. I feel perfectly fine. Yeah. And we to polish up on. We just went to Bhatkal today. Quality on the way here. We did that fish and that prawn biryani. I mean, it was amazing. We were actually supposed to stop somewhere, maybe Shetty lunch home, or we were supposed to go to you know Murdeshwar. But somehow, you know, destiny conspired to take us there. Nice. It was very good. You know, that's the mark of a good place. We rode two hours after that. We've spent two more hours here. We'll stop. And we're still talking about that Bhatkal biryani. So although there's no chicory, it has yeah, good it body. Oh, so it's a deep roast. So I, I've been roasting ah. at home for the past five years. Fantastic. So we've just discovered that they also have a coffee estate, and in fact, I was quite enjoying this coffee. But next time, I'm going to ask him for the coffee to be a little hot. Now I'm really looking forward to our uh, dinner here. I asked him. The expectation, the bar is, sir. Huh? No, I'm, I'm getting scared. No, no, don't get scared. We've been told it's a surprise, so I'm really looking forward to dinner. Coffee is excellent. Just look at that view behind us. Fantastic. This is what they call a million dollar view. And that's the beach that connects to the property. That glorious view. So this is a uh, a little away from Gokarna main beach which I'm told I've never been there but I'm told that's quite packed these days and uh, this is called lovely beach honey beach this is called honey beach sorry just soaking up the energy of that of the setting sun. There's something about the ocean that is it's quite hypnotic. As you listen to the waves. Mesmerizing. Looks like fish. <laughs> Actually, paneer. Paneer, paneer masala. Oh, baby palms, right? Hmm. How's it? I haven't tasted it. I'm just saying. Hmm. I'm doing a kripal like. Hmm. Mm. <laughs> Palms are great. Masala is not. The fish is very fresh though. Mm. Missing the masala needs a bit of balance. Right now it's very kara. Mm. No, just some sourness, some... Too much punch, man. It's got too much, uh, just the chilli, raw chilli heat you're getting. There's no flavour heat. Yeah. Mm. Just chilli. Little, little mm. bit of sourness. That's right. But the fish either, makes it up. Either some vinegar or some tamarind, yeah, you know. Sourness is missing. Awesome. Mm. I'm missing you. For you. But better than the fish fry we had yesterday. Mm. Hmm? Yeah, yeah. yeah that, that thing. <laughs> it's 
deep fried no yeah but paneer is that like paneer tikka would have been i don't know if they have a tandoor or whatever well made paneer tikka is good as well so what is the loot salute salute cheers 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 guys cheers fabulous setting absolutely brilliant what a excellent job finding this place it's brilliant it's brilliant Kabu, this is good, huh? Bolinger, silverfish. So good, yeah. Very good. It's awesome, man. Fresh, no? Very fresh. The Ooh. fish is very fresh. Perfect rawa roasted stuff. Mm. Yeah, and also it has a rawa to balance things out, right? Perfect spice. I think the quality of the fish, yeah, is very good. Very fresh. Excellent. Excellent. More coming. Oh, yeah. 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 will be like killer. Uh, Fish curry, bangde. Bangde. What is this? Prawn. What is this? Good fish. Prawn. Prawn curry, bangde. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, how do awesome. I take it, man? Good that we are not riding. Yeah. Some foreign. Imagine riding the water. These are what? Uh, ah, sea crabs. Sea crabs. Lovely. Nice. Lovely, man. Yeah. Masala is the real fish. Prawn. Prawn curry. I haven't cut the tails off. You, if you cut huh? it off, you lose flavor. Ah. Yeah. The so crab is amazing. The combination of uh, Mangalore and Kerala. It's <laughs> a lot of food. <laughs> There's some chicken even. So we've got some uh, rice also. crab, we've got some fish curry, we've got some prawn and some chicken. Is this is no a pepper chicken? What is this? This is... Uh, it's an imitation of the cook chicken head. Ah, okay. With the karta masala? Yes, uh, it's got karta puri. You got oh, some kacham puli in there, okay. Oh my god, man. You got a kacham puli? Kacham puli is uh, Garcinia. So it's basically a it's saring a dark egg. color. This is basically a feast out here. It's going to get better and better. Some prawn curry, fish curry, and some chicken. <laughs> today was a great day for food, mm. wasn't it? Yeah. That fish biryani we had for lunch. Yes. Hey, today was an outstanding day for food, actually. Here is food. Here is food. The spices that you use in that crab masala, excellent. Fabulous, man. Mm. So I don't cook them. Give us the secret. I don't cook them 100 percent. You yeah, yeah. cook it about 40 percent, uh. and then you dump it in with the crabs. Oh, so the crabs also don't lose their flavor. <laughs> the masala also has a raw flavor. But a lot of aromatics that you use. Yeah, but even the spices huh? are not very lightly roasted. Put the crabs. So things like cinnamon yeah. and clove, yeah. coconut, chili yeah. garlic. Uh, tamarind paste. <laughs> There's tamarind paste, a huh? little bit of tamarind paste. Oh, that's delicious. That crab. I think next, let's taste some of that. Some of the prawns. You saw Kripal, there is one fish curry coming. Kripal, Kapitan. Mmm. Oh. Do not disturb. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, the crab and the beef. This prawn masala is like a tomato and yeah, tomato. Uh, do you have some cream? Chilies, huh? Chilies. Why do you? How do you have that thickness? You put some cream in there. The cream, coconut, coconut, coconut milk. Ah, it's basically coconut cream. Mmm. Mm. And also, I think you will poach the prawns for some time in that. Little bit, in a little bit of prawn fish curry. So you wanted to firm up a bit. Little bit. Otherwise, it's too soft. Right? Too soft. Yeah. So you probably saute it before you add it to the curry. Yeah, so that's why it gets a little hard. Only in the last all the seven minutes. Mmm. So. That prawn is excellent too. So it's got this lovely Life coconut good, cream. Life is good. Tomato. Yeah. There's a warmth from some red chili spice there, but quite gentle. Huh? Gokarna fish curry. It's local. It's nice and spicy. Uh, nice and spicy. So it's like a puri munchi type. Similar. 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 It ah. goes very well with uh, kori roti. With kori roti. Yeah. But we will taste it with the adna. Yeah. Ah. Extra chicken. Masala, hmm? I want this to be the lingering taste. The crab masala is After. the best. 
Mm. One thing that you need lingering right after the meal should be this one. There's a lot of pepper in the chicken. Yeah. Mm. Again, you got the I think the aromatic spices most that you use. Hmm. You grow your own spices, is it? From Vietnam. Ah, that's fine. Roast till it becomes like coffee powder. So in the Kodawa thing, they also add coriander yeah. and yeah. jeera and all of that. Slightly off beat. So karta masala is a dark masala that the Kodawa mm. use. Okay. That is what goes into the pandi curry, pandi curry and all yeah. that, and along with the kachumpuli. Mm. So it's a you masala that's roasted. Off. To that coffee color to bring that color. so karta basically means dark right right <laughs> karta 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 masala karta masala karta masala karta is a manalam word also karta is tamil karta karta is not in my head for oh, that crap the sweetness the of that crap flesh and that and the yeah, the spices the lingering warmth of the spices mm. very good and yeah, this is the sort of crap I can't stop having this. Mm. You gotta literally chew. It's a nice suck the flesh out of the flesh. The plates are a mess. Thanks, Aditya. You're being an excellent host. Why did you sit with us? Seriously. My dinner was much later. I'm used to standing like this. Nothing after it. None of the videos or anything didn't jump out. And the crabs also were sweet. So fresh and they're young. Yeah. Big crab. Yeah. Big crab prawns. These are the ones. Same thing with prawns. Chennai at one point of time you only used to get the small prawns. Yeah. Nowadays you don't get this. Yeah, the small prawns. Nowadays you don't get the big ones or whatever. But the small one that has maximum flavor. Mm. I'm enjoying this meal thoroughly. It's locally also. What's nice is it's also got the prawn head in this. Mm. So you can suck the. Yeah. Mm. You can suck the prawn came. butter mm. out of that. The sound came. Hmm? The sound came. came. Mm. Six people. The best dish there was a malige dosa. First today's dosa, basically. And the stew and the chutney that we had today. But out here, I mean, almost everything that we tasted. Good food today. today. Everything has been yeah. exceptional. Palm bread stuff and the Quality silver fish. Food. Today we had three excellent meals, right? Right from yeah, the day. breakfast. Good food. Good food. To the Bhatkal Biryani and now of course you have all in all a good day, yeah. food wise. Roast kulfi. Yeah. This is with the cream inside, na? Give me a roast kulfi too. Saw me also. Well, since we are at it, why not go the whole... Gila ho gaya to naha ke ni pista. Pista. How is it? Nice. Sridhar endorses it, that means it's good. Mm. Thank you. All the bikers riding all these big machines, but what do they succumb to? <laughs> A roast <Thank> kulfi. <laughs> uh. I think deep inside there's a there's a kid in every one of us. I think bikers mostly, even more so, right? Bikers mostly. Hmm? I think the bikers live their yeah, life exactly, and you know we're kind of. More in touch with ourselves, I think. I think the amount of time you spend alone in the solo in the road gives you a lot of time to think, think and think about that roast will be or have. No, no. So when you ride in the morning, you think of the lunch. You know, then post lunch you think of dinner. Then you sleep, thinking all of what you ate in the road. An unexpected twist in the end. Didn't expect to find this roast kulfi. And after all, you ride by the beach. So during the daytime, when you go to the beach. Step out with one of these. Thank you. How was the massage? Namaste. Namaste. This actually, this pink goes with the pink of your bike. <laughs> no, the massage is pretty decent actually. The steam. I think, you know, after the ride that we had yesterday, all the aches and pains just kind of disappeared, especially with the steam at the end. So, I highly recommend it. And the view is spectacular. I think it's all about the view right here. So while you're getting massaged, you're looking out and the, it's just the ocean, the waves coming in and the sound and everything. So it's, uh, Boiled and then mashed up, yeah. then garnished, it's very tasty. Yeah. Spicy? No, not spicy. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. Maybe no. some green chilies, little green chilies, that's it. No other masala and all that, just plain garnish. This is from a particular part of Tamil Nadu or everywhere? No, everywhere. Yeah. Even in Chennai, you'll get in many, all the... Suraputtu. Suraputtu. So well, the morning has begun with conversations on food and we're looking forward to lunch today. 
heading to Karwar and no motorcycles. Yes, Innova coming 12 o'clock. Innova coming. So we said we're going to take a break from all the riding and uh, go for lunch to this place in Karwar. We'd been there years ago when we did our last ride in this region and uh, we're looking forward to returning. But for now I'm told the kitchen here has organized some breakfast for us and I'm told it's going to be interesting. We're on. Starting the day with prawn curry. <laughs> Kripal, yes. uh, it feels that I'm on a Sunday morning in Kerala. Sunday morning in Kerala. Only appam is required. You said that with a lot of disdain. That is veg tomato. It's your friend, man. One man's food is another man's poison. Prawn, I do vegetarian. He's changing the topic. <laughs> Eat one and see. No? At least convert him to non vegetarian by now. <laughs> but don't show disgusting face here. <laughs> no, I'm sad that he's missing all this food. Oh, that's why. That's the reason. The disgust is for that. Oh, Not oh. because he's eating vegetarian. Not because Ganesh is vegetarian. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> The slight tart sweetness of the banana and the cumin, the flavor of the cumin with some coffee, bliss. <laughs> some dosa with the prawn curry for breakfast. Mm. <laughs> the dosa prawn curry combination is decent. Do you get some prawn? You got no? I got. So this is more like a teaser for the lunch that's planned for the day. And that is a typical seafood lunch in Karwar. <laughs>